Santiago players are wonderful, as you will find out very soon. And we have some original compositions that w original composition that we asked for specifically for the big read, but more about that later. Look at the bottom of your program, the very bottom line is my phone number and my <coughs> email. If you would like to perform, if you know somebody who might like to perform, that's how you let me know. And if you just want that one monthly nudging email, you have to send me one. So I put you on the list. That's why I know it's spelled right. So send me an email. If you're going to change your address or if you know somebody who might like to know, then send it to that email address that's at the bottom. Um, <clears throat> if it bounces back, it's gone. I just throw it away. So for whatever reason, if your machine doesn't take it, so you might tell your spam people that this is actually legitimate. Also, I promise I will never give it away. You're only going to get one nuisance email a month. <laughs> uh, you're not going to start getting advertisements for drugs or property, OK? <laughs> so um, without further ado, the Santiago players. to uh, make one, one program announcement. Um, we will be changing the order <coughs> in the program of um, A Dream Within a Dream and the Manuel de Falla set. So you will hear the Elegy, Doppelganger, the De Falla set, third, and then A Dream Within a Dream mm -hmm. and Diary of a Black Widow. So they'll be switched. Mm -hmm. um, we're the Santiago Players. Our primary mission is to perform and do workshops and teach in Guatemala actually. We just got back from our summer tour there. We worked in the Highlands with communities that don't have a lot of access to classical musicians, but there are a lot of young kids who know how to read music, who play classical music, and so we go work with them. And we like to also do some of the music when we come back home to California. So thank you for coming.
night, the streets are asleep. In this house lived my sweetheart, though long ago she left this town. Yet the house still stands in the same place. A man stands there also and stares at the sky and wrings his hands with grief's violence. I shudder when I see his face. The moon shows me my own form. You doppelganger, you pale companion, why do you mime my love's suffering that tormented me at this place so many nights in bygone times? Thank you. 
Let me avoid you all. 
for mezzo, soprano, violin, and viola. We've done a special arrangement for you today for soprano, cello, and piano. And it's called Diary of a Black Widow. It's called Diary of a Black Widow, and it, uh, it's inspired because um, a few years back, I found a black widow in my kitchen. <laughs> and my first instinct was to kill it, but she was so beautiful that I put her in a jar. And I felt bad for her, and I put another spider in the jar so she had something to eat. And within an hour, she wrapped the spider up in thread, and I was just fascinated by the whole thing. So I decided to make her my pet. And she lived in my kitchen for a year and a half and ate crickets and was very happy until she passed away of old age. <laughs> this is a song cycle. It was, the poetry was written by local poet Lauren Eggert Crow, And um, it's written from the point of view of our black widow. Thank you. 
that um, in the program it doesn't say who's who in terms of our singers. Yes. <laughs> this is Kyla Knox. Hi. And this is C.A. Jordan. Thank you very much for coming. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.